people old enough to remember. What were you doing around this time in 2000? Watching wrestling. Playing outside. My two boys were one and three, so I was probably watching Thomas the Tank Engine, Blue's Clues, or Barney. Just began a new career and a month away from my wedding. Still work for the same company and still married to re same woman. Edit. Additional info. Second job post college and first and only marriage. April of 2000. Probably watching Dragon Ball Z or Pokemon. I was still writing assembler code for special mainframe projects back then. Primary school. Wishing I did not had to take math. And now I use it every day lol. Working and selling Y2K products and COBOL programs to other companies so their old dated software. Would keep working. Playing outside trying to do circus tricks on my bike back in Montreal. Getting ready for our trip to Jamaica to get married. Heart. There was school camp. For whatever reason. My school went first. Out of the six elementary schools. That year. So it was early. Mid-April and cold as balls. For a little extra insulation. I actually slept in my life jacket because it was so damn cold. Two of the other boys in my cabin slept in the same bed that first night because of the cold. We had canoe races one of the days. My partner and I got cut off by the cool kids. Who wound up winning the race because they cut the course. We were supposed to go around asterisk the floating dock. Not cut inside of it. There was a boys versus girls pillow fight one of the nights on the hill between the cabins. Some of the girls put their shoes inside their pillowcases for extra leverage. But I was still on my life jacket kick from the first night. So I put that on for armor. There was a mountain man who gave a presentation one night where he talked to us about taxidermy and stuff. He showed us a fresh skunk fur that he scraped off the highway. Playing rock and roll in NYC. April of 2000. I would have been nine years old in the third grade and getting excited for spring break and Easter. And since it's April 1st, I would have been pulling April Fool's pranks on everyone lol. In an occupational school. In Texas. March if 2000. Let's see I would have just graduated high school early by testing out in the late fall so that I could go to college sooner. But it's a Saturday and I didn't have any weekend classes because I worked 16 hours sat 16 hours sun. Shifts at the hospital so that I would still be full time and be able to go to school full time. That means I would have been at work. And I worked evenings in overnight for those shifts. TL. Doctor. I would have been working the evening shift on the physical rehabilitation side of a hospital. Facility in Eugene. Oregon. Hmm. End of March. Early April 2000 I was working with FT job and taking FT classes in college. And trying to raise my now oldest son as he was a toddler at the time. Living carefree and playing the sport I love all day. Every day. Summer breaks were the best. Studying. Gloating over the value of my stock options that would tank a year later. Going to my junior prom. Exclamation mark. I was born. I was back home from my first deployment to Kuwait. And preparing to leave the army. At this point I had about eight months left. Probably banging my hot GF after high school. I was in VPK. I was taking my first ballet lessons. Probably out with the person I had just started dating a month earlier. Didn't realize I had met my future husband just beforehand. We wouldn't start dating for nearly another year. Still. I'm glad I dated the other person for that time. We had a lot of fun together and learned a lot about ourselves. And learned from each other. I don't mean in a sexual way. 
just in a life experiences way. It helped make me into the person my now husband fell in love with. I was in preschool. I know my family went to California in April, May of 2000. We crossed into Tijuana, which was the first time I had ever gone to another country. Waiting around for Y2K. I was four months pregnant with baby number two.